do not punish what you want to have happen. So here's an example. Imagine that you that you've married someone that you find attractive. And then imagine that other people find that person attractive as well, and that that's actually somewhat threatening to you. And then instead of dealing with the fact that you're threatened by the very thing that you were attracted to and that you're blessed to have, you start to punish the person that you're with when they manifest themselves as attractive. Well, you do that for 10 years and the attractive person is no longer there. And then you're going to be angry at them, even though it was completely your fault. 